Welcome back. We heard what uh, head coach Matt Painter expects to see in Purdue's matchup with Rutgers tomorrow. We're also talking to the guys on the court to get their thoughts about tomorrow's game as well. Sports 18's Maddie D'Addario is live again for us at the United Center in Chicago with more. Maddie. Yeah, Jeff, we've seen some changes with this Purdue team over the last few weeks, especially with that starting five. But one thing that has been Purdue's strong suit all season is their depth off the bench. For the majority of this season, the starting five we've seen has been Zach Eady, Caleb First, Ethan Morton, Braden Smith, and Fletcher Lawyer. Who we saw a lot of at the beginning of the season in the lineup was Mason Gillis. But due to a back injury, Gillis was starting less and coming off the bench more. However, in the past few weeks, Gillis and his roommate, Brandon Newman, have both crept into that starting lineup. Newman became a key component on Purdue's defense, and Gillis, known as Purdue's glue guy, strongly contributed to transition play. But with such a late season switch to the starting lineup, many are left wondering who those five will be tomorrow against Rutgers. Gillis shares what plays into making that decision. Uh, seeing where we're at whenever we play that competition, um, if people are tired, if people are not tired, um, if somebody has the shooting stroke going, um, you know, there's a lot of different things. Just being ready is the biggest thing. Who's starting tomorrow and who's coming off the bench doesn't really seem to me much of a concern for this team. They're saying all season has been lose as a team, win as a team, and I guess we'll have to find out tomorrow what the outcome will be. Reporting live from the United Center in Chicago, Maddie D'Addario, Sports 18.